Hi, everyone. Joe for Jaspi's Case Breaks Talk. Well, more baseballs coming at you. Break number 34. We've done a ton of these today. Thanks, everybody. 19 spotter. One spot gets you nine players. One person will get any and all multi-signed baseballs. Pretty great list here. Very big thanks to this group for making another break happen. I appreciate it. Let's uh, multiply you by nine. Four. Nine. Now let's grab all of your names, put them into a blank list. Let's grab all the player names, put them into another blank list. We'll put the result of the randomizer in that first tab there. Let's roll it, randomize it. Three and a six, nine times for names and players. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Got some Eugenes down to Adam. Three and a six, nine times four players. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Got Jock Peterson down to Luis Severino. All right, let me just show you the list as is, and then we'll alphabetize by your first name. And then you can see all of your players grouped together. Obviously, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna read off all these names because too many names, gotta preserve my voice. All right, now, alphabetize by your first names there. Aaron, there's your last spot, Mojo group of teams. Players, that is. Adam, there's your group right there. Eugene, there's your group. Oh, right up to there, right up to Kyle Hendricks and then James. There's your group right over here. Obviously, with 171 players, this is a, not, not an easy one to hit in, but if you do, that's going to be a fun addition to your collection. Josh, there are your players. Manuel, there's your group right there. And last but not least, Matt, there's your group. All right, we're going to pause the video. I'm going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. BRB. All right, TWC trade window closed. Let's do another three baseballs. Let's see what we got. Got some nice ones the last round. We have some nice ones in general. Let's see if we can find three more nice ones. All right, we got an active player here. I think, I guess you would talk to PSA about that. All right, first baseball. Um, active outfielder and DH now, nowadays. 35-year-old righty. Played for one, two, three, four teams my entire career. 288 batting average, lifetime. 1,522 hits. 282 home runs and 899 runs batted in. A five-time All-Star, a World Series champion, a three-time Silver Slugger, an AL RBI leader, hit four home runs in one game back in 2017. I didn't realize he was on this first team. He, got, he was originally drafted in 2006 by the Twins in the 36th round, but didn't sign. And then went to Nova Southeastern University, where he played college baseball from 07 to 09. Set the career home run record. And then was selected in the 20th round of the 2009 draft by Houston. 
I didn't realize who was with Houston. I don't remember those. Yeah, Oliver. Nailed it. J.D. Martinez. Yeah, he was in... J.D. Martinez was in Houston from 2011 to 2014. But then I, I remember his Tigers days, and I remember his his Astro or his uh, Tigers days and Diamondback days. But there it is, JD Martinez. Yeah, James ended up getting it too. James, this is yours, by the way. There's the MLB hologram sticker, and I don't see a Fanatic sticker on this, but. J.D. Martinez, going out to you. All right, next baseball. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's see what we got here in this one. Oh. Oliver has some old Bowman Sterling rookie cards there. All right, another active baseball player. Now, this player hasn't been around for very long, but Already has a lifetime 277 batting average. He's a righty outfielder DH. Already has 120 home runs, 296 runs batted in, and 107 stolen bases. He's already part of the 100 100 club. Three time All Star, NL Rookie of the Year, two time Silver Slugger, NL Stolen Base Leader, 30 30 in 2019. Who am I? Yep, Kevin's got it. Oliver's got it. Ronald Acuna Jr. That's going to go to Eugene. There you go. There's his auto right there. I think you got both, both holograms right there as well. Nice one, Eugene. There you go. Third and final one. Good luck. So a lot of fun, folks. We got another three in the store. If you want to get after another one before the night is out, jaspiesbreaks.com. We had this player a few breaks ago, so these stats will sound familiar. But righty starting pitcher, win loss record seventy four and fifty seven, a three four two ERA, uh, one thousand one hundred eighty nine strikeouts. Played for two teams my entire career, and this uh, particular baseball, I think there's an inscription on. It. I think the previous one didn't have an inscription. Uh, his inscription. Uh, is regarding his 2021 All-Star appearance, selection and appearance. The year he was a uh, NL strikeout leader. Yeah, we had this one before. There you go, Oliver. Zach Wheeler. Did the previous Zach Wheeler have a All-Star game inscription on it or no? I don't think it did. I don't think it did, right? Because the other one, I don't remember an all-star game stamp on the baseball. That's the other cool thing about this. You might see, you know, some names get get a repeat sometimes, but but there's a lot of different kinds. All right, Zach Wheeler, third and final, is going to go to James. James with two of the three. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.